what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? Since the coronavirus outbreak, there has been an uptick in xenophobic and racist incidents aimed at the Asian community. Now Cardi B is chiming in. In fact, she is caping for the Asian community. Cardi says, enough with the jokes, it ain't funny. She's tired of looking up and seeing Asian people being attacked. She says that if there's any time for us to come together, it should be now. We're all equal in the eyes of God. I disagree. Not the part where we're all equal in the eyes of God, but the part where she says, if there's any time for us to come together, it should be now. It is my belief that we should always come together. But you and I know that's not the case. So why should we come together now? This is a very serious question, family. Why is it that when another community or another race is under some type of attack, it's time to kumbaya and everybody should join in. But when black people are under constant attack, we're on our own. Nobody's there collectively to ride for us. I haven't heard members of the Asian community speak out one time in all of the thousands of black people that have been gunned down by the police. All of the tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands of police brutality cases, I have yet to hear the Asian community stand up and say, we with you, my brother, my sister, I'm with you. Now, I don't agree with people just going around beating people up. I don't agree with none of that. But this racial thing, you know, Asian people have been racist against black people for a long time. And you can go on the internet right now. I don't have to try to theorize this. This is fact. You can do a quick Google search and you'll see all kinds of videos, thousands of videos of incidents involving Asian people attacking black people, not just verbally, but physically. So forgive me if I seem a little indifferent. You did? Like, why do black people always have to concede? Why do black people always have to take the higher ground? Why are they always looking for black people to conform? I don't get it. I don't get it at all. I love who love me. I hate who hate me. I rock with who rock with me. I support who support me. If the Asian community would collectively ride for black folks, I'll be the first one pumping it up, waving the flag, busting on behalf of my Asian brothers and sisters. I'm here for you, baby. But I don't see that same type of energy when black people are on the short end of the stick. I don't see it. Members of the Asian community collectively are sitting back watching the action and saying, well, not my problem, not my problem, not my problem. So why should black people go out of their way to be respectful at this time when the Asian community is suffering and being attacked? Why should black people go out of their way? I need somebody to answer that for me. 
Don't give me that where well, you should just do right all the way. I, I, damn all that. Did you miss what I just said? I said I support who support me. I love who love me. I hate who hate me. I need some consistencies. Fair exchange ain't robbery. You rock with me, I rock with you. Well, let me break it on down. Because some of y'all may not understand that. Scratch my back, I scratch your back. That's how it go. That's the way of the world. Fair trade. You do something for me, I do something for you. Not, I do something for you, 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 you do nothing for me, I do something for you, I do something for you. That ain't how it go. So, I ain't feeling it. I'm not feeling it at all. The jokes, eh, like I said, I'm indifferent. I'm not sitting back laughing at the jokes myself. Uh, like I say, I mean, right now, the Asian community is being marginalized. They, they're not a marginalized group, but right now they're being marginalized. And I don't particularly uh, like uh, kicking somebody when they're down unless they're a direct threat to me, an imminent threat to me. So, but I am indifferent because they've been indifferent. You see, this is the energy being reciprocated. You know, like if it would have been different on their end, it would be different on my end. I'm going to give you what you give me. It's simple as that. So let me say it again. I love who love me. I hate who hate me. I support who support me. I don't support who don't support me. I care about who care about me. It's that simple. Why is that so hard to understand? Or is it? Drop a comment, let me know what you think. No more talk. What the haters talking about? Yeah.